Hello, this is the Bulldozer, and thank you for watching one of my videos. Have you ever wanted to download something that you liked on Facebook, something you saw on Twitter, or even a YouTube video? Maybe, you know, you have a loved one in a video or something on YouTube, and you would like to go and get a copy of that video for your own personal records. Today, I'm going to show you how to do that, as well as how you can go and get the audio from a video on YouTube. Let's get started. First things first, if you do any of the things that I show you in this video, I will not be responsible for any malicious file that you download or anything of their sorts. All the stuff I'm going to show you today is stuff that I have used for myself, stuff that I've uploaded to Twitter and downloaded, downloaded it back to my computer. It's nice to have a copy of it online, that way it also saves the space on your computer. Sometimes you might want to copy that back. So again, the disclaimer, everything you see here is going to be a try at your own risk that I will not be held liable for any damage or any malicious acts that happens to any of your devices you're trying this on. This has been safe for me, but I have to say a disclaimer. I saw your mole! <laughs> you We're going complex, to work on man. getting this eat video breakfast. right here off of Facebook. The Facebook channel you just seen there from my flaps. gaming channel. So I'm going to show you how to go and grab this video. First you have to go to the video you want. Then you want to take the video and you want to get it over to the mobile side of Facebook. But how do you do that? You simply right click the video and a box will come up and it will say go to that video's link. And when you do that this is the page you'll see. The video that <laughs> you want to use <laughs> give me a complex, and man. all the comments have been placed on that video. Breakfast. But you're wondering now, how do you get flaps. it to the mobile version? Well, that's easy. I just forgot to breathe. What we're going to do is we're going to go up to the top of the page, and we're going to highlight www. Just that. Nothing before the first W. Nothing after the last W. No periods. No nothing. No slashes. Just www. Once you highlight that, hit, hit M hit enter. M stands for mobile. This is the mobile version of the video with the comments with all the other stuff that's been taken off the page. So you want to simply play the video then you want to <laughs> right click the video. <laughs> you give me a complex And man. you're going to do you save as. When it brings it up breakfast. it's going to bring it in mp4 format which is a video format <laughs> and just name it what you want. I just forgot to breathe. I put funny I'm, NFL on too many U's there. Just a clip. So now, let's go open that clip. One thing I do suggest is that <laughs> I saw your when you're downloading <laughs> stuff, Give me a complex, always man. run a virus scan on it beforehand. I've already done all this, then so I know this stuff is I safe. Have flaps. There's the video. It's that easy to download a Facebook video. Okay, now let's go to Twitter. It's actually a lot easier to download a, a Twitter video than it is Facebook. This is my own video. So what you want to do is you want to go to the three dots underneath the video. You want to right click and hit copy that link to tweet. That's going to come up. Then you want to copy the link. Then you want to go to downloadtwittervideo.com. That will bring you to this page. You paste it and hit enter. When you do so, you're going to see the video that you're just looking at. And you simply just take in, follow the steps, download it successfully, and that's it. And there is the video. See, it's really easy, nothing complicated to it at all, and again, that was actually easier than doing Facebook. So now, let's jump over to YouTube 
and show you how to get a video from YouTube. Here's my YouTube channel. You see my video there, you know, made a put a video up on, about how to clean up your Upload Studios um, software on Xbox One. So we just want to go copy this link, then we want to go to keepvid.com. K E E E P V I D.com. Simply paste the link up there next to the to the left of the download word. Don't click on nothing on this page. You know, it says content can't be played. Disregard that. It's just a catch because they want you to click there. Don't have to worry about that. Just paste your link in, in the white box and hit download. That's all you got to do. And once you hit download, you will get a selection that's going to come up. And it shows you the different formats you can download it in and stuff. Now, sometimes you want to be careful because sometimes it might say video only or audio only. So what we want to download is the MP4, the Max 480p. That's what I always download. We're going to download. We're going to open it up. And it's that easy. There's our video that we just got from YouTube. But let's say we want to get audio from a YouTube video. Well, you're going to want to jump over to this website, youtube-mp3.org. You see I got a highlighter there for you. And then you want to take that link and you want to paste it in the box and click on convert video. Again, you're going to see the picture of your video. And you're going to see the title and the length. Then it's going to tell you the percentage on how far along the process they are. Then once they are done, you see it's 100% downloaded. You will see a download icon, or just the word download. And on mine, it's it's in blue. I think it's how it is on most paid most computers. But it could be different on yours. But you'll see the download link where you can take in download the song. And there we go. You're going to take and click on the link. You want to open the file. You can see it is a audio file. It's an MP3. So we're going to take and we're going to open that up and we're going to bring over the little window that shows the video we're playing. Okay, now it's done. I'm going to click on open. And I'm running a dual window setup, so I gotta drag it over from the screen one over to screen two. And you will hear the audio plan. Again, there's nothing else you need to click on this page. Don't click no ads or anything, because they might look safe, but you never know. Only do what you're supposed to do and go. There's the audio file. And you can hear it playing. It's that simple. I hope you this helped you out. If you would, if you're watching this video on YouTube, please hit that like button. I really appreciate it. And also, don't forget, all the steps I've showed you, you're trying at your own risk. This is the bulldozer. Thank you for watching.